It is time now to shine the spotlight on one of our Sun Lake staff members. Today Anita Lawrence introduces us to Kara Lukasik, our new Recreation Director. Here now is Anita. Hello, I'm Anita Lawrence, your Good Day Sun Lakes host, and today we'll be shining the Channel 97 spotlight on our new Recreation Director, Kara Lukasik, who began her tenure with First Service Residential on August 23rd. Welcome, Cara. Thank you, Anita. It's great to be here today. It's my absolute pr pleasure to be able to introduce you to the Sun Lakes community and learn more about you and your background in the recreation industry. Thank you. I'm pl glad to be here. Well, we have some questions for you. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> All right. Can you tell our viewers a little bit about your background in the recreation industry? Sure. I come from the outdoor hospitality industry, dealing with RV resorts and marinas. And I was there about 12, 13 years, most recently in Hemet at uh, Sun Lakes, excuse me, <laughs> Sunland. See, they're similar names. Um, Sunland RV resorts. And we did lots of group events, lots of resort-wide events, focusing on creating memorable experiences for people who are there for the day, for the weekend, or for the winter time. Good. Well, your title is Recreation Director, and we've had many new residents move in over the last year and a half. Can you describe to them what your duties are and responsibilities? Sure. As the Recreation Director and the Recreation Department, we're responsible for um, making sure everybody has fun. So that's the multiple swimming pools, the multiple clubhouses, the north, the south, and here in the main, the library, the veranda, and all the different rooms that the clubs meet in, the um, arts and crafts room, we've got the billiards room, and all the fitness centers as well. So making sure that all the equipment works right, everything is up to stuff because we are a resort mm -hmm. um, and um, making sure then that all the groups and clubs and individual private parties that we that are held here um, have the information that they need we've got tables and chairs set up right AV equipment just to make sure that their event runs smoothly and that they create those memorable experiences for their um, parties that they're gonna have here and you also uh, book entertainment. Yeah, uh, also, <laughs> sorry, I forgot about that. There's so much. Yes, so we also do in the rec department, we do various events throughout the year. Upcoming, we're going to have a Led Zeppelin tribute band come in October, so that's going to be really great. We've also got um, like ice cream socials, some small events throughout the year, and we do some tribute concerts. We help with charities. We do a veterans walk, things like that that we'll organize throughout the year. And then Linda and I have been working on on some new things um, to throw in to add some new excitement or to take some of the events that are currently that we've done for a while and maybe tweak them a little bit and inject some new fun and interest in them. Well that that leads me to my next question because mm -hmm. I was going to ask are you going to offer residents some new and exciting activities that they may not have had in the past? We hope so. We've got some ideas on the plate or uh, because we are such a vibrant community one of the things I've struggled with a little bit is finding space to have some events uh, because they're the club rooms are all booked, but we'll give us some time and we'll have some neat things c coming up with talking to the board and getting approval on some things. So in the near future, you'll see some more fun things from us. That's wonderful. What is your favorite part of your job? I love meeting people. I love talking to people, where they've been, what their experiences are, because I think that truly then helps us in the recreation department um, finding out what things are people are interested in, what things that they'd like to do here, uh, so we can help to tailor programs to meet people's needs. Mm -hmm. um, so meeting people, learning about where they're from, what they like to do, is all about what I am. So come see me, stop by, give me a phone call, shoot me an email. I'm here. Okay. I'm here for you. Do you. So you do have an open door policy? Yes, ma'am. Come and see me anytime. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I might not know what I'm asking for, but definitely come and see me anytime. <laughs> well, you are known as the queen of fun. That is true. I didn't bring my tiara, but yes, I do have a tiara now. So okay. I'm officially crowned the queen of fun. Well, 
if you're the queen of fun, what do you like to do for fun <laughs> when you aren't creating fun <laughs> activities for the residents? Well, I kind of live a quiet life. Um, my daughter still lives in San Diego, so um, I am from San Diego. Um, it's where I've spent most of my life at this point in time. Um, so I like to go and visit her, and, and now I'm the tourist in San Diego, so I get to do all the fun things, go to the zoo, uh, walk around Little Italy, and do those things that you don't do so much because you live there. Um, other than that, I like to read, I like to watch old movies, I love to cook, so gathering with friends and family and sharing recipes and talking about books and movies. That's kind of what I do in my spare time. I like a lot of those things too. <laughs> we have a lot in common. We do, yes we do. Well, is there anything you want to add that you'd like the residents to know about you before we wrap this segment up? Um, no, you know, I'm here to make sure everybody has a great time. Um, if there's something that you've seen someplace else or you've heard of in a different community that your friend lives in, let me know um, because Linda and I are open to all kinds of things. We just want um, to make sure that everybody has a great time while they're here because this is such a great community. And so we want to continue that with things opening up and just have a great time because we're the queens of fun. <laughs> well, thank you, Cara. I <laughs> appreciate you. you being here this morning. Well, it was great. Thank you for joining us today for this Good Day Sun Lakes a segment on Spotlight on Employees. And if you haven't had the chance to meet Cara yet, please stop by and say hello the next time you are in the, the main clubhouse. I'm Anita Lawrence for Good Day Sun Lakes, and I look forward to the next time we shine the Channel 97 Spotlight on another Sun Lakes employee.